My name's Adele. I'm 42 years old and I live in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. I am a PhD student at Duquesne University in uh, healthcare ethics. I struggled with alcohol use disorder for most of my life. I've been in active recovery for two years, over two years. I wanted to find a way to use my experience with alcohol use disorder to contribute to what was going on or what it continues to be occurring with opioid use disorder in the United States and globally. Stigma is is the biggest barrier to getting tre seeking treatment, getting treatment, made, and, and being able to, to maintain recovery is because there's so much structural level stigma to personal level stigma that can be a barrier to, to recovery. The sympathy is not there. It's it's we it, it, we're attaching that, that we're making that a, a character issue, and that's that's something that goes along with a lot of substance use disorders. Is that we want to attach that we want to make that that person's fault. What I wish more people would understand about opioid use disorder and, and addiction is that it's a condition like other conditions that 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 people have. It's it's an illness that people live with, that people recover from. Look at me, someone who who struggled through my own substance use disorder um, for decades and, and often felt uh, very unloved. Even even when I was surrounded by people who, who loved me, um, felt that I was in the bottom of pit of despair, but I was able to find resources myself. There is a lot of love out there for individuals who are struggling with opioid use disorder, with substance use disorder. There are so, I've encountered so many amazing people to seek out resources um, because there are so many people who, who want to help.